Welcome to All Tech Queries, a solution for all your technical queries. These days, every mobile manufacturer is introducing a 5G phone, and every mobile operator is also trying to get the 5G technology first. Because of the hype, consumers are also becoming eager to get their hands on the 5G network. But do you know really need 5G? You will get the answer when you understand what is the difference between 1G, 2G, 3G, 4G, 5G. In this video, we will learn what is 1G, 2G, 3G, 4G, and 5G, and what is the difference between them. We will also learn what is LTE and VO LTE. We will also answer. How fast is 5G? Is 5G better than 4G? And will 4G phones work on 5G network? The letter G indicates generation of network. There are several generations of networks like 1G, 2G, 3G, 4G, and the latest 5G. The technology is improved with each generation. What is 1G? The first generation was introduced in 1979 but became available to the public in 1982. It had a very low data speed of 2 to 4 kilobits per second. There were many drawbacks in the first generation. Analog signals were used to transmit data. The mobiles used to have an antenna on them, and people were only able to make a call. There was no internet access and you can't even send messages through 1G phone. Furthermore, the 1G phones were heavy in size and had limited battery life. What is 2G? The second generation, 2G, was improved and introduced in 1991. 2G used GSM technology. It became very popular at its time as people were able to make calls and text others. It was possible because 2G uses digital signals to transfer data. Even mobile companies like Nokia started to make featured mobile phones with amazing features like games, torch, etc. The mobile phones used to run on Java-powered OS back then. However, the speed of the 2G network was limited to 64 kilobits per second. Later GPRS technology was introduced in 2G, which enabled web browsing and email services. It was called 2.5G. What is 3G? Then comes the revolutionary 3G network, which offered transfer speed in megabytes. As the speed of the 3G network was up to 3 megabits per second, people were able to access the internet. The 3G network was initially introduced in 2002, in a few countries, but it was available in most countries by 2008. Also, there weren't many devices that supported the technology. Mobile manufacturers started using the Symbian OS to provide a suitable user interface for the users. However, with the release of Android operating system in 2008, the 3G network has grown exponentially. Android phones allowed users to download several apps, and it literally turned mobile phones into mini computers. Moreover, since the launch of YouTube took place in 2005, people started adapting to the 3G service, and internet users all over the world have rapidly increased. However, with 3G, people were having difficulties in browsing internet videos, as they used to buffer a lot. Therefore, several improvements had been made to the 3G network and released as 3.5G, 3.7G, etc. What is 4G? The craze of 3G networks was still fresh, but a more advanced network was introduced around 2010 called 4G. Some countries adopted the 4G network in 2012, some in 2013, and some in 2015. 4G can provide a speed of up to 100 megabits per second. Moreover, with 4G, you can even watch high-resolution videos without any buffering. Besides that, 
video calls over the internet have become much smoother. What is LTE and VO LTE? Initially, 4G used LTE technology, which stands for Long Term Evolution. Having a speed of 100 megabits per second, it was great for browsing the internet. However, it used radio frequency to transmit voice signals. Therefore, in the earlier days of 4G, people were having connectivity issues. The calls interfered, and it took longer to connect to a person. Therefore, mobile operators started sending voice signals through LTE itself. Hence, the improved technology is called VO LTE, Voice Over Long Term Evolution. What is 5G? The latest generation of networks is 5G, which was first introduced in 2020, but it is not available in some countries yet. 5G claims to provide internet speed up to 1 gigabit, which is 10 times faster than 4G. 5G provides high-speed internet and will allow you to watch videos in high quality without buffering. The data transfer between two 5G devices will be much faster than 4G. Here are some of the most asked questions regarding 4G and 5G networks. How fast is 5G? The initial version of 5G is launched and it offers up to 1 gigabit of speed. However, it may improve over time and will be much faster. Is 5G better than 4G? Yes. In every aspect, 5G is better than 4G. 5G is 10 times faster than 4G and lets you browse the internet at high speed. Moreover, the voice quality of the call will also improve, and there will be fewer connectivity issues. Will 4G phones work on 5G network? The short answer is number 4G mobiles will not support the 5G network. 5G provides better features, and 5G phones are more expensive than 4G. However, you can use 2G, 3G, and 4G network on 5G phones. So, which network technology are you currently using right now, 2G, 3G, 4G, or 5G? Comment below and let us know. Also, check out links for related articles and videos in the description. If the video was helpful, like our video, and subscribe to our channel All Tech Queries, for more tech-related, informative videos, and how-to tutorials. Follow us on other platforms as well. Links in description. Thank you.